everyone. Today we are going to go through the figure four stretch. Um, this is one of the best stretches for the glutes, hips, low back and sciatic pain. I am going to spice it up a little bit from the normal figure four variation. So make sure you watch through to the end so that you have a few different options to see which version of figure four might feel best for you or perhaps you want to do a few versions. We're going to be on the floor but I want you to have a wall nearby as well. So for the first version of figure four, we're just going to go ankle onto the opposite knee. Now, if you're really tight, this might be enough for you to already start to feel a stretch in that glute. If not, press the knee away. If that's good for you, hold it and take one deep breath. If you need more of a stretch, you're going to reach through the supporting leg and pull it towards you. If that is enough for you, a few deep breaths. If you need more, pushing that opposite knee away. The next variation is using the wall. So foot onto the wall and then ankle over the knee. Now, depending on how close or far away you are from the wall is going to depend on how good the stretch is. So I'm quite close to the wall for my own body and I'm also going to press the knee away for more effect. And again, once you've found your level and what works best for you, that's when you're gonna start using freedom. A lot of my clients will find the wall is more useful whether they've got as much hip mobility as me or whether they are further away and they'll because they don't have to hold that leg it's much more comfortable they don't strain the neck or shoulders it's just an easier more comfortable position to be in Each time you're breathing out, try and relax the tension around that glute. All right, we're going to move into another variation here. So on your next bit breath out, I want you to start to rock your knees over to the side. Inhale, come back to center. Exhale over to the other side. Inhale back to center. If you're finding it's the least and you need more stretch, bring yourself closer to the wall or you can lift your heels or you can do both. So that's our figure four stretch. Choose which level works best for you. Definitely give it a go with the wall. You'll be surprised how much better it is. Um, make sure you do the same on both sides and really use that breath and the exhalation, that breath out 
to help you release tension from your body, especially in those tight muscles. Thanks for joining me.